Hello, my name is Gillian and welcome to Frizz Biscuit. Today I'm going to tell you a story. A story of one girl's adventure into the weird and wacky world of Gishwiz. What the hell is Gishwiz? Is that even a word? Allow me to explain. Gishwiz stands for greatest international scavenger hunt the world has ever seen. Gishwiz! It was started by the amazing Misha Collins and he basically decided, oh, how can I increase the awesome and the weirdness in the world? I know, I'll create this international scavenger hunt where people have to ride camels, perform flash mobs and create Japanese tea ceremonies in elevators. Gishwiz! Another one of the challenges was making sure that we filmed everything and put it together into a documentary. So then I discovered I really like talking to cameras, partly because it's less crazy than talking to yourself. And I already spend most of my time on YouTube anyway, so I decided to become a vlogger. Let's call out my origin story. Gishwiz! So the Gishwiz experience, coupled with the fact that some of the people that I admire most in the world are vloggers, nerd fighters, made me decide that I wanted to become a vlogger too. You're welcome, universe. So let me tell you a little bit about myself. As I said before, my name is Jillian. That is not spelt with a J. It's spelt G-I-L-L-I-A-N. If you spell my name with a J, I will not talk to you. And if you think my name is pronounced Gillian, I will not talk to you. Say it with me now. Jillian, not Gillian. I just thought we should get that out of the way with now. I am a total music nerd. You can tell by the fact that every Friday night, I'm not partying with friends, I'm not at a club. No, I'm playing clarinet in a concert band. That's right, I'm that cool. I used to really hate wombats. When I was in primary school, we went on an excursion to the zoo and the zookeeper told me that the wombats ate six cobs of corn every single day. And I didn't like that because I liked corn and I didn't want the wombats to eat my corn, so I decided I didn't like wombats. I've only owned one mobile phone in my entire life. Yeah, Nokia. And I only even really got this one because I got into a minor life and death situation and I realized I should probably have a way of calling for help if I'm about to die. I really love winter and I really hate summer. Summer gets really hot in Australia and the way I see it is in winter you can always put on more clothes to keep yourself warm. There's a significant limit to the amount of clothes that you can take off in summer, although some people don't really follow that social norm. I can't whistle to save my life, so if some creepy hooded character comes up to me on a darkened street and points a gun at my head and says whistle or I will kill you. Yeah, I'd be getting shot in the head. As you can tell from my t-shirt, I'm a major Doctor Who fan. I'm also a fan of Harry Potter. You are my childhood. Yay, fantastic beasts and where to find them. Oh my god! I'm also a major fan of anything that was created in the Whedonverse. Yay, new Firefly comics! Woo! I cried during the final episode of Spicks and Specs. It's a music quiz show, but it was over, so I cried. Before you ask, no, I'm not sure how I'm going to get through the Fault in Our Stars movie. John, why did you have to make it so sad? I'm gonna be sending you a bill for all the tissues I had to use to get through that book. Why? I always break out into song in public places. When I find myself in times of trouble, Mother Mary calls to me, my life's a musical. So that's just a little bit about me. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button and that lovely subscribe button down below. I'm gonna try and make weekly videos. I don't know if I will. I'm gonna try though, so you should subscribe so that you see all my new weirdness. And that's all folks, bye. Ooh, postman. Sorry, I ordered books. I thought he'd bring me mine, but he hasn't.